App Creator, Monetization Features, Commerce, Part 1. Alright, so I'm going to split the Commerce um, application or feature into two parts. The first, we're going to set up your store, which is this one. The second, we're going to set up the, um, the actual uh, items in your store. So, once we click on Commerce, the first thing we want to do is press the plus sign and enter in all of our store information. So, uh, for instance, things I sell. Okay, email could be store or maybe contact at store.com. Keep in mind this is all for tutorial purposes. Um, so we're going to use a lot of fictitious names. 2819. Um, let's put Orlando. Country is United States. Okay, and I have a phone number here. We're going to do 800 700 6,000. Hours of operation, I'm going to put 24 hours. Now we have to choose our delivery method. It could be either in store, carry out, or delivery, or all of the above. I'm going to do in store, carry out, delivery. Um, now, when we choose delivery, we have to choose the delivery fees, if any. Um, just to make it simple for tutorials, I put 10, which would be $10. Um, free delivery starting from, let's say we do um, $100. So they spend $100, there's no delivery charge. The client calculates the change. I'm going to leave that blank here. Um, also, um, for delivery radius, this is going to be the amount of miles or kilometers in which you deliver. So maybe you only deliver within 10 or 20 kilometers. Um, of your of your store so we'll put that here if you have delivery time um, if you I'm um, guaranteed 30 to 45 minute delivery you can do that or you can just leave that blank as well you can also put a minimum order here then you have to select which payments you're going to accept so that could be PayPal cash check meal voucher if that applies to you and you put those out there um, or credit cards so I'm going to do since um, we're going to pretend that this is an online store and a physical place. We'll do PayPal, cash. We'll do credit cards. We can take all of those. Uh, we'll leave check and mail voucher unchecked. Um, now, just so you can see, I'm going to deselect PayPal um, afterwards. But just so you can see, when you select PayPal, you're going to get these boxes pop up. You have to put your username, your password, and then retype your name here in the signature box. And this is going to be the PayPal in which you will receive payments through. Okay? Now, um, we have to configure our taxes. So here in the state of Florida, the tax is between 6.5 and 7%, uh, depending on which county you're at. So I'm going to put 0.07 for 7%. Now, once I'm done with this page, I'm going to select OK. Once I get that green light, we'll see that my store is set up. All right, so in part two, we're going to go over how to integrate the catalog and orders, um, how to do, uh, put different items inside of your store, and so on. Thank you, and I'll see you next tutorial.